Dale, bésame, ven y atrápame Hagamos jueguitos que de chiquito no pude hacer Dale, bésame, ven y atrápame Que ahora tú sabemos bien lo que vamos a hacer Dale, bésame, ven y atrápame, ven y atrápame. Hagamos jueguitos que de chiquito no pude hacer Dale, bésame, ven y atrápame Que ahora adultos sabemos bien lo que vamos a hacer Dale, bésame, ven y atrápame Hagamos jueguitos Ven y atrápame Que ahora tú sabemos bien lo que vamos a hacer Hey guys, welcome back Ooh, We've driven about a thousand miles As you seen, some of the, found a little cool town in Nebraska Camped overnight in Nebraska we are now in southern Wyoming in the Medicine Bow Route something National Forest, Medicine Bow National Forest. We have found this amazing dispersed spot, overlanding style. It was a little sketchy getting in here. Uh, we wanted to go all the way down by the lake, but we decided to play it safe and stop. We actually had to back up on the trail. A lot of uh, boulders and risky, you know, just risky stuff. Our truck's not lifted and we don't have, um, it's just not lifted enough and, you know, the suspension's still stock. So we maybe would have made it, but there was a real, there was one area that I was really worried about. And of course, Jack wanted to do it, but uh, we just didn't want to take the risk and get stuck. We already kind of got into a little bit of a spot, which was not good in the, uh, camper was like grounded a little bit but the sun's going down behind the mountains just, you can't really see it but it's beautiful out here and we're just getting camp set up it's getting dark we got to cook some burgers and then we are at 10,400 feet elevation we're flatlanders highest back home is like a thousand so there's quite a breeze grandma's over there freezing it's gonna be good sleeping tonight here she comes she's about, she got a lot to say I'm telling you no no it was, what? It was a little ridiculous. And Wait, you're not in they focus. They never listen, and I know we couldn't make it that far. Oh, you be quiet. And it's cold, and there's no taco. What? There's no tacos. <laughs> Let's not talk about. We're it. making burgers. No, we're making chicken. Oh, that's right. Oh my chicken god. Chicken sandwiches, marinated With avocado on there, in the dark. So... Jack's off taking pictures. Jack's taking off so taking selfies. Photo shoot, yo. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Photo shoot. He said. Photo shoot. Hey, so oh my god, I can't take it. And this kid didn't want to come. I don't. <laughs> stop. But I'm gonna get good pictures. Okay, stop it. You know we're getting good okay, pictures. Um let's get cooking or there's gonna be no food and I'm gonna be hangry. You're already hangry. Let's have a look at these mountains. And we will show you where we are. It is open. I thought you're grilling on the back of the truck. Um, what? The the blackstone. Are you just gonna try to put in the iron skillet? I don't care what we do. It'll be way faster. I'm eating a donut and I'm supposed to be watching cars. That's how frustrated I am. Oh please. Let's just do it on the back of the, the camper because it'll be quicker with the iron uh -huh. skillet. But look at the view on this side. I, I have to get busy. You'll see better shots, probably. There's, there's little holes all over in the ground, so I don't know what critters are coming out of She's here. She's afraid today. of the critters. Well, let's go back here so you can see the cooking. We don't have the bathroom set up. Is there any firewood? Oh, we have all this wood here we could use. I don't think you're supposed to do fire. I just we need you to start cooking. It's here. gonna be black in like five Open minutes. Tank. Ooh, yeah, 
Who are you talking to? Peanut gallery starting the chicken. Hangry and all. Stop, cause it's... Tell us about the dinner. Okay. Not taco night. Um, Ooh, first still of all, no taco um, night. Big Daddy said, oh, you don't need any sweatshirts. You don't need any sweatpants. It's gonna be 80 degrees. Why are you packing all those cold clothes? Um, I'm glove. freezing. My hands are red. I'm, like, I'm having a harder time using the knife. Let me tell you, I am not a happy <laughs> Oh, please. Every time he's wrong. No, not I once, not twice, hat. every single time. I actually think I need a hat on. That's how cold it is. I'm buried all this stuff. Can't even get... I'm marinating some chicken breasts, cut them thin. We're grill, or cooking those up. I've got some tomatoes, some avocado, and a little bit of lettuce, and some pita bread. We're just gonna make some chicken sandwiches. That's it. Easy night for tonight. Ooh. Oh my God, it is cold. It's a little late night. Live today, camp kitchen meals with Melissa cooking. Hey, okay. No, I'll be over and just do it. Stop. Oh, there's the city lights. As yeah. we're burning our cutting board. I need a lift. Okay. Take care of your chicken for you. Um, Jack's trying to get his face clean with one hand. Oh, we forgot to tell you. Um, Jack broke his wrist at football, so he's Last sporting week. a hot pink cast. Last week. So he's trying to figure out how to do everything with one hand. So he's trying to do his beauty regimen of his facial with one hand. I, just, I, just, I can't take it. I, just, I gave him a baby wipe with some cleaning facial stuff and I don't know. I, I, I Look at what I have to deal with. Do you feel bad for me? It's already, I don't even have the mayonnaise in there. Oh, is it a pita? It's a pita. You're not calling it a sandwich, right? No. There you go. Lettuce, tomato, avocado, chicken, and Swiss. Hold that mayonnaise. Woo! Can I turn this off? Yeah, turn it off, babe. That's how it's going down tonight. You didn't put the mayonnaise on it? Yes, I put the mayonnaise on it. I'm just trying to. Well, I don't even want Swiss cheese. Well, you're out of luck, there, Padre. You're out of luck, Big Daddy. That's not right. Here's how it looks. Nice and toasty. I know, but I need some With water. Some I need the other one. No. That's like, fine. That's not but... right. Cold. We've never been above 8,500 was the highest we've been when we were at North Rim, Grand Canyon. This is like 10,004. And camping at this is awesome. Me and the stars, it's a clear sky. It's going to be a great night. Except I'm getting smoked out. Today was our longest day. We had 566 miles. Too long. It was, it was worth it getting out here. This is one of those once in a lifetime, well, for us, because we're living in the Midwest. This is a great spot. I need a hat. Okay. <laughs> you got a hood. It's not winter, it's just windy. It's like 48. It might be warmer than that. Mm -hmm. You better get ready. Fall's coming in winter season, hot tent. I'm not ready. Yeah, but I'd be in the warm hot tent. It would be nice and toasty. Yeah, except for setting all that up. You bought us buns. No. You went back for that. Didn't even get me. How many Swiss cheese? Chatter American Provo and anything but Swiss. And a moonshine. I gotta dig that out in a little bit. Hey, there's not. I'm gonna go. 
I'm going to abandon him with the wolves and the bears, and I'm going in the camper. Um, we already know what. They know that. It happens every time. Black bears, I doubt it. There's not grizzly country. We saw a ton of elk and deer on the way in. There is moose out here, but I don't know about this high up. Dang. Don't bring any cold clothes. That's I did not nice. say that. I said you don't need like five sweatshirts. Yes, I do, because every time we go out, it's cold. Every single time. No. Every time. Well, what did you say last time? Oh, I should have brought a jacket. Yeah, because I didn't have anything. I have a jacket and this long sleeve shirt, and I'm still cold. Well, I think we're calling tonight. I'm going to pour a drink and maybe sit here for a little bit. She's going to bed. But we'll see you in the morning. I'm sure it's going to be an amazing sunrise. Run some breakfast and then... Coffee. And then another, hopefully not as long of a day of driving. Yep. Heading to Utah. Check it out. I'm not sure it can get much better than that. Well, um, coffee. I don't know. <laughs> this is a little chilly. 37, 40. This is easily, easily the best spot we've camped in. Gets me a little uh, choked up. What a view. Unbelievable. Turning the wrong way. Look at her preparing her burrito, avocados and all. Okay. Look at her. Stop it. You about lost my eggs. It's been so long since she's had a burrito. It's killing her. Put some eggs on there with some chicken and some tomatoes. Here's your burrito, avocado and cheese too. What? I don't want no avocado on mine. Oh, it's already up. Wait, this is my weekend. Eat it how I it's make it. your weekend. There you go, babe. There you go. That's ridiculous. Why do I have to eat a burrito? Is that mine? That's yours. You're welcome. Gee, thanks. I'm so excited about it. You take that burrito and like it. I think she may have made it maybe a week without eating a Mexican dish. It was horrible. Worst time of my life. A little coffee. I've got a little Door County cherry cream this morning. Yeah, I need the coffee. It's like 30 some 45 degrees. I'm working on it. I wish this was not just a one night nice stop, but I'll take it. Can't beat this place. This is truly the kind of camping I like. We don't get this back home much. You say you want coffee, but you got the drone up again. I'm trying to get these del amazing shots for the people. I'm trying to eat this amazing burrito. <laughs> yeah, that's what she's most excited about is the burrito. Mm -hmm. wow. Yes. Why? We need some sour cream and salsa. No. I think there's some in there from last trip. You never took the salsa out. Don't worry. Courtney's over there waiting for us. Two more days to get there, and it's going to be a nacho table. Oh, I can't wait. I'm super excited. This looks like it's some kind of old house here. Mm. Torn down. You see it on the drone. Uh, from the old west, I suppose. I don't know.
Time for the coffee. I'm gonna say it because you keep saying it. I'm gonna it. say actually, 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 actually. Stop doing it. There is another. There's a gold jack. I think. There's two big holes. I don't know. It's got tons of like old cans, broken down old like shoes. So I don't know if it's from when they cleaned up the area that all that just kind of got put in there from when there used to be maybe some cabins and stuff. But there's a couple of fire pits that are out here. Like maybe somebody who was like tent camping. Because I can't see you actually driving your... I mean, I guess you could drive your vehicle all the way back in there. Not at Maybe either. someone kind of walked up in tent camp. So the, I guess if you walk around the tundra up here, there are other areas that they have made into... Like there was... Oh, this one doesn't have any. It's the other one that had all the tin cans and stuff in it. Cool. It, me and uh, Jack walked down to the water. Um... There was two campsites that we found. We'll include some pictures. They were really nice. It was nice and spacious, and they already had um, built up rock fire pits. One even looked like it had, like, I don't know if it was a thing to hang, like, food on or if it was a hunting thing. Jack was trying to figure that out. He thought it was a way to, to snare rabbits, I guess. Um, so that was pretty cool. Okay, but it was a nice walk down. Um, so there are, in the, the short amount of area that we came up on, there were three designated campsites that already had rock pits out there um, that were really nice to camp at. We chose to just go off road cause, and just make our own kind of campsite because it was just too hard to get down uh, closer to the lake, but it actually worked out really well. But it was a nice time. It's beautiful out here. It's a lot warmer this morning since the sun came up. Me and Jay got up this morning. We saw the sunrise, made some breakfast, and just enjoying the day. Now we're gonna head back down, which will probably take us a good 45 minutes to maneuver all the rocks to go back down. And then we'll kinda trot around town, check out some other areas.
beautiful, it, Wyoming is definitely a beautiful place to come to. Um, we will definitely have to come back, stay longer. We needed one more than one night, but I'm glad we got the chance to come out. So that's it guys. That's a wrap on our... So it's a shorter week, uh, this episode. Cause we're, we're in the... One nighter, we're in uh, Medicine Bow National Forest, Southern Wyoming. This is our backdrop. As you saw, all the drone photos and the amazing sunrise, just, I could just And I just got some stay. water shots. I could just stay here. But we are back on the road heading to our next destination, which is... You'll see next week. <laughs> Such so, a big mouth. <laughs> it's not goodbye. We'll see, see you, you soon. soon. Con tus labios rosados Yo me muero Por una prueba de placer Siempre que estoy a tu lado Lo que siento Nadie más lo podrá saber